Samsung is one of the top leading industries for consumer electronic products. As customer service representatives in Samsung Contact Center, we serve as a first point of contact to customers. To them, we are Samsung. When a customer calls, most of the time it is because they have an issue or inquiry about a product. It is our duty to provide world-class solutions to them no matter what roles we have in the contact center. This video will present what a day is like in Samsung Contact Center. We provide assistance to customers through various channels, whether through the traditional channel, the hotline 1-800-SAMSUNG, or through emails. We also have digital channels like the live chat, remote management for TV, Phone. And we find out from them whether they are satisfied with us via our post-service survey team, happy calls, or customer satisfaction surveys. Not to forget, one of the more challenging roles in the contact center, our VOC team, or voice of customer. Let's hear from some of our representatives in the contact center. I'm Lorraine, I'm the contact center manager of Samsung Singapore. I'd like to share what my experience with you on the call center operations. Okay, so when I first joined Samsung Contact Center, I have this aspiration that uh, we want to expire to get number one position globally. That is a very tall order because we have 55 subsidiaries that we need to compete with. And of course, the response from the team is that uh, they actually think that it will not happen but within four months uh, we actually worked very strongly together as a whole team and we have um, been making breakthroughs and miracles that we managed to turn around situations um, to get number one position globally. So I will hope that this uh, legacy will continue okay? and all the newcomers um, are very important because we will be the representative of Samsung, we will be the first contact point for customers. So I believe that if you put your heart and soul and uh, to serve the customer well, you will get the job satisfaction as well. So I urge that uh, all of you to continue the hard work and efforts to um, you know, do the best for the organisation. Our client and us, we share a common mission to bring Samsung Contact Centre towards greater achievement for our contact center to be renowned for its exemplary service experience within and beyond the electronics industry, both Singapore and globally. Through an agent's work performance, how they adapt and whether they display a cohesive and cooperative team spirit, we can usually tell if they show promise to grow beyond their role. For those who display strong leadership skills, they are further groomed to take on more roles and responsibilities and marked to become a future team leader. So we are very serious about training them and providing the right incentives to help motivate the agents. My role as a subject matter expert is to support mobile device operations and inquiries in Samsung Contact Center. I have to ensure my team is updated with the latest information and skills in new mobile device products. We have a knowledge base site which has the latest information for all mobile device models and it serves as a useful tool for agents to get their answers. My duty is to ensure agents use this resource effectively. We also conduct monthly refresher training for agents who may be weaker in certain areas or topics. 
During the refresher, agents will have hands-on practice which gives them a better idea of how the product works. I will ensure that resolution they provide is from the knowledge base side or give them training by extracting their core samples and pointing out which area can they improve on or provide them with further troubleshooting tips or alternatives. Well, basically I assess all the agents' goals. I ensure that agents adhere to a set of standard guidelines and ensure conformity and cons consistency in their call etiquette. Um, of course, if any agents are not conforming, then we'll do coaching, the necessary coaching. Well, I will start with highlighting their strengths to encourage them and then I'll inform them on what areas they need to improve on. Furthermore, we have a senior trainer with us who provides uh, in-depth training sessions based on the previous month's findings, for example, like dealing with difficult customers. Or let's say if we find that um, agents appear to be down or unmotivated, then we'll try to talk to them like a friend or on a personal level to find out like what's going on in their personal lives and to counsel them. And of course, we will also tell them the consequences they have to face if let's say they fail our grading repeatedly. I'm holding the position of Voice of Customer Advisor, which involves the first level of service recovery in dealing with disgruntled customers who have already called into the hotline and have not been able to accept the resolution. There was a case which I had to check on from EJ, which he could not bring closure to. This involved a customer who was enriched about her new Galaxy S5, which failed to work within two weeks of purchase. She had called in demanding for an exchange for phone immediately. All efforts made to explain on no exchange had failed. I quickly took the matter up with the service centre manager, verified with him if exchange can be proceeded if the fault was indeed with the product, and then I make the necessary follow-up with the customer. Upon getting a positive response from service centre and receiving the update that an exchange would be made for her based on stock's availability, she was finally pacified and accepted the plan of action provided. I have been working as a technical advisor here for more than a year and a half. Mainly is to be able to adapt quickly, understand and assist people, customers who may be of different backgrounds and making sure they are satisfied with my overall service. There was this time whereby a customer called in shouting that her phone was having an issue after updating the Android version. She went down to a service centre and was advised that they would need to replace the motherboard. She was frustrated as she had to go through a lot of trouble backing up her phone data to her computer and so basically I went the extra mile and assisted her for two days, guiding her on how to back up her data and restoring them after collecting her phone back. She was actually surprised that I could remember the slightest detail on the device. I remained calm throughout the whole process and took responsibility by ensuring that all of her data is safe. Uh, most importantly, I listened carefully to what she had to say and empathized with her situation. I see myself mentoring or even training new agents. It's a way for me to share my experience to others, just as how I was mentored when I first joined here. At the end of the day, it's not just about work in Samsung Contact Center. We work hard, but we also play hard. Ha <laughs> ha